After an up and down season, Nordskogel still had a shot at the Skogel League Division 1 championship on the last night of the regular season. Their game against Pottsville was tight, but the Crimson Tide ended up winning 15-9 to take the league title. Doug Weiss played quarterback in that game and threw for 262 yards and a touchdown. Weiss returns for the Spartans this season, and he should have a lot of time to operate in the pocket. You know, importantly, uh, when you look at offense and even on the defensive side, the guys coming back to are, are up front. Um, and that, that, that was something that's been developing for two years. And, and not only the guys that are returning that played a lot last year, um, but guys behind them to back them up. So um, we're hoping that that's a strength um, and that'll help us utilize a lot of our athletes that we have. Weist is one of those athletes. He started playing cornerback last season as he competed with Richie Zahodnik for the starting quarterback spot. Eventually, Weist earned the role as Zahodnik starred in the backfield and at wide receiver and safety for the Spartans. How much did that make you better, maybe him pushing you as, as you look at your senior year? Oh, it definitely made me better. It made me a better uh, passer the way it is because he, I really needed to show the coaches like what I can do. And he was just a little bit better than me at everything, so I just had to work hard, work hard, work hard, and once it happened, that's, I just kept pushing myself and just progressively got better. The Spartans do have to replace Sahodnik and three-time All-State linebacker and talented running back Major Jordan, but they seem confident that they can fill their shoes. The Spartans started five freshmen at one point last year on a defense that posted four shutouts and only gave up more than 17 points twice in 12 games. The entire defensive line returns from that team. The Spartans have the athletes to make plays on special teams. Last year they scored on a kickoff return for a touchdown and they returned two punts for touchdowns against in Shenandoah Valley. Special teams, you know, biggest thing is kicking. You know, you know our coverage teams are always good. Um, you know, thing is where we missed out is is the kicking part, the extra points, the field goals, being able to kick a field goal. Um, you know, from from a better distance than close up. So that, that's one of the biggest things is, is our kicking. Do you have a kicker in place who maybe could do these things for you? Or? We do. Um, you know, fortunate this year we got two soccer players. You know, they're going to handle a lot of the kicking duties with the addition of kids on the team that had some of the kicking duties before. It could be a special year for the Spartans and quarterback Doug Wiest in the Schuylkill League. Yeah, I feel the Schuylkill League is getting more of a, a pass feel to it. When I was little, I'd always read the paper every Saturday morning and there weren't a lot of quarterbacks throwing over a thousand yards in a season. There was a lot more thousand yard rushers and now it's starting to even out. So I definitely feel like it's getting a more balanced offense. Make sure you grab the standard speaker every Saturday to check on the Spartans because even though the media picked them to finish fourth out of six teams and the coaches picked them third in Division I of the Schuylkill League, don't be surprised if they have another shot at the title when they travel to Pottsville in October.